And Liz, all the officers involved in this shooting were injured, but we're told their injuries are just minor and not life-threatening. As you can see, it's still an active scene right behind me here. It is still taped off, but here's what happened earlier today. Police tell us when officers arrived to serve the suspect with his warrants, he ran through the back window of the house. Then that's when the suspects and the officers got into a con confrontation right in the middle of the road here. During this confrontation, the suspect was trying to grab one of the officers' gun, and that's when shots were fired. This neighbor who lives right on West Bay heard the shots. Take a listen. I mean, I heard four gunshots, like three, four gunshots. I knew they were gunshots. So I came out and the neighbors came out and that's all I saw. The suspect was shot and killed. The suspect's cousin tells me he was just 20 years of age. Reporting live in Denver, Sally Memdu, Denver 7. Sally, Liz, thank you both very much. And this is the second time Denver police have shot and killed the suspect in just the past week. Over the weekend, they shot Terry Salazar when they say he refused to drop a knife. Investigators say the officers were cornered in an attic off Fox Street near Ellsworth. And at first, they tried to use a taser. When that didn't work, one of the officers opened fire. 